These 11 teams will be racing around the world for $1 million. I'm really excited about this particular cast. We're best friends. And roommates. We both run track and field. We used to run track and field at UC Riverside. Yeah. Like, we're sprinters, so fast, fast, fast all the time. Jasmine and Danielle, competitive. We definitely bring the athleticism, like the physical ability. Yes, not like, like oh, we go to the gym on the weekends. No, like we, we like are hardcore clean. athletes. We are news anchors from Santa Barbara, California. We're dating. We actually started off as coworkers. When you work in the news business, it is a competitive, hungry business. We work under a deadline where you know I got to be live on TV in five minutes. The stress factor is something that we're comfortable with. Like we um, got, we got, we got two swag, two furious. Sexy, you know. I mean, okay. our dancing is going to help us in the race a lot. I mean, yeah, our dancing uh, has got us to go to uh, Germany, Germany, China. I mean, like, dance is a universal <clears throat> language, you know? I want to see them do well because I know that they have really struggled. Right now I'm working four jobs. Well, uh, I sleep uh, at my mother's house. Winning the race for these guys would completely change the way they live their lives. If we don't win this show, I'm going back to sleeping in my car. Our motto is to have fun and cash the check. They kind of make fun and have fun with people who are in the limelight on a show called TMZ. We work in like a very fast-paced environment of celebrity news. We work in a, in a lion's den. Queen. That dress was disgusting. They will provide is an unfiltered assessment of all the other teams. We throw shade for a living. <laughs> you either like us or you don't, because we're very harsh and blunt. Denise and James Earl, here you have a very conservative mum. I'm straight, he's gay. <laughs> okay. She's religious and I'm not. So when I first came out, that was a, a, a bit, little bit of a conflict is a better word. He called up the phone and said, Mother, I'm gay. And yes, the first thing I said, and I wish I could take it back, but you're going to hell. <laughs> there are a lot of disconnects between these two. Probably graduating med school. I feel like that's my biggest achievement so far. And mine was him. I think there'll be some challenging times, uh, her being my mom, because she still wants to treat me like a child, and in this we're no, like... No, I don't. Oh. You just got to show respect. I'm an OBGYN in San Diego, and uh, she's, a, she's a dentist. We've been married uh, about a year and four months year now. Year and three months. A year and three months now. This, this race is going to be really good for us to see how we work as a team yeah. before we get started on a family. This is really going to test them. I, I don't... I, I just don't think they have any idea what they're in for. The fact that we're both very hard-headed. Yeah, if it yeah. comes down to something that we both feel very strongly about, we're going we're gonna to clash. Logan and Chris, our job is we're paparazzi. Mm -hmm. Always competing against other teams of paparazzi. So yeah, we're kind of, it's teams. similar to the show in that regard. Big telephoto lens trying to get the shot. You know, Logan um, has become known sometimes as the um, pinup paparazzi, so that's a little strange because we'll be on the beach shooting and she'll be in a bikini shooting. Uh, the edge of the other teams, I think, is our athletic ability. Tanner and Josh, two very good looking best friends. I have a feeling they're going to distract uh, some of the young women. You know, our strategy comes with, with if we have to flirt with the girls to get them on our side, we're going to do that. Our faith is both really important to both of us. We're both strong Christians, and so at the end of the day,